Hey, from the circuit, draw a leprechaun bunny. Yeah, a bunny with a leprechaun hat. We hope you're going to follow along because it's going to be a lot of fun, right? Yes. Yeah, and what do our art friends need? Markers. Markers or something to draw with. You also need some? Paper. Paper. And we're also using markers to color with. We're using our Art for Kids hub markers. These are awesome, but it's okay if you don't have them. You can use whatever you have at home or in the classroom. Yes. Like crayons, colored pencils, or even oil pastels. Yeah. All right. Because we're using markers to draw and color with, we're also using marker paper to draw on. That helps keep the markers lasting long. Yeah. All right. You ready to start? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Let's first draw our bunny's nose in the middle of our paper. I'm drawing it towards the bottom though, but in the middle. That way we have room for the hat and also the tall ears. We're going to draw the letter V in the middle of our paper down here. Next, let's draw the top of our bunny's nose. Yeah, and then let's also draw the eyes. I'm going to draw a circle on the left and also a circle over here on the right. And we're trying to draw them the same size. And that's okay if they're a little different too. Oh, like how big you drew your eyes. That's awesome. Now let's draw a smaller circle in the top left of each eye. This makes the eyes look shiny. We're going to color in the big circle, but leave that little circle white. This part will fast forward too. So remember to pause the video and take extra time to color in your eyes. Yeah. Now we're ready to draw the mouth. Let's draw a little curve that comes down from the nose and up on the left. And I'm going to repeat that same curve on the other side. Yes. And then we can also add little bunny teeth on the front. I'm going to draw a line down, over, and then back up. I know what I'm going to do. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> Are you going to leave the teeth off of your bunny mouth? Yes. Oh, good. And I love that your drawing doesn't look exactly like mine. That's okay because the most important thing is... To have fun and practice. Yes, have fun and practice. And you can change your drawings any way you want too. Okay, you ready to keep going? Yeah. <laughs> now let's draw the shape of our bunny's head. I'm going to start over here and I'm going to draw a curve that comes down for the cheeks. We're going to go across the mouth for the chin and then back up on the other side for the other cheek. So you can start right here. Oh yeah, or you could start there. Go down, over, yes, I love how big your bunny head is. We're going to have a very small bunny body and that's perfect. Okay, now let's draw our little leprechaun hat. I'm going to draw a line that connects over across to the other side. And I'm going to extend these up too so that it connects. Yes, and then you can also connect right here too. Okay, now let's draw the top of our bunny's hat. We're going to draw a line that comes up here, so it can come up right here. Yes, and then we're going to come up over here too, on this side. And then we can connect those at the top too. Oh, your hat is huge. It's <laughs> awesome. Now let's add the little design on our bunny's hat. We're going to draw a buckle, so I'm going to draw the letter L right here in the middle. Yes, and you could draw it a little bit bigger too. You could come up to there and also over here. So we want it to be equal on the side and also on the bottom. And then we're gonna draw the top to over and down. Yes, and then let's draw a square on the inside too. So I'm gonna draw an L and upside down L to match. Perfect. Okay, now let's draw the belt or the part that comes across from the buckle over to the side of the hat. Yes, and then let's do the same thing on the other side. And let's do that below for the bottom on each side too. <laughs> What's our bunny missing? The ears. Yeah, the ears. Let's start right here. And we're going to draw a line that comes out. And then we're going to curve around and then come back down and connect to the hat. So start here, come out around and connect. Yes, and we're going to do the same thing over here. And we want to come up to the same height so that both ears are the same size. And we'll come down and connect. Yeah, <laughs> I love your drawing so much. Now we're going to draw the inside of our bunny's ears. We're going to repeat that same step, but draw it smaller inside for the left ear. There you go. And then let's do the same thing for the right ear come around and back down and connect. Yes. 
We did it. Now what's our bunny missing? A body. Yeah, a body. Let's come down here and we're gonna draw two lines. We're gonna draw one and two. And yours can be really short. Oh, and far apart. <laughs> <laughs> now let's draw a little curve for the left foot. Yes. Oh, and I like that you connected it too. And we're gonna draw the other foot over here. Yes, and then we're gonna draw a line to connect those two together, the feet. Yeah, you could just go straight from there. That works perfect. And then let's also draw the belly. I'm gonna draw a U shape or letter U that comes around and then back up. <laughs> and then we can also draw the arms and then I'm gonna draw just a cute little arm that comes out like this and then back in. There you go. And then the same thing on the other side. We did it, Olivia. We finished drawing our leprechaun bunny. It looks really cute, except we're not completely done. Still need to color it. Yes, this part will fast forward. So remember to pause the video and take time to color your bunnies too. You ready to fast forward? Yeah. Olivia, we did it. We finished drawing and coloring our leprechaun bunnies. Yours is seriously my favorite. Thank you, I like these too. <laughs> Thanks. I especially love how big you drew the head. The next time I draw my bunny, I'm gonna draw it that big. <laughs> now you can pause the video right now to match the same coloring. You could even add extra things. Yeah, we added hearts to our drawing, but our art friends could add different things. They could add gold coins. Or background. Oh yeah, full background. That would be really cool. Again, we used our awesome Art for Kids Hub markers to color with, and if you have the same set, we used 88 pink for the ears, and also the nose and the cute Pikachu cheeks. Then we used a light yellow, number 26, for the face, then the body, and also the outside of the ears. What color did we use for the hat? Green 54. Yeah, and then we also used 35 yellow for the buckle, and 103 brown for the belt that goes around the hat. Yeah, but you can color your drawings any way you want. Yeah, you don't have to match the same coloring. We hope you have fun drawing a leprechaun bunny with us. We do, we hope you had a lot of fun, and we hope you take extra time to add more things to your drawing, and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye! Goodbye.